Last year, there were a total of 131 confirmed cases of child abuse in Racine County. That is nearly a 30% decrease from previous years, which may sound like good news. However, as our Evan Peterson explains, the truth is much worse. At a glance, it may seem like an odd sight. When you're putting these pinwheels in the ground, you know, th think, think about the child that that's representing. A bunch of bikers clad in leather planting a pinwheel garden. The, the evil that that child had to endure at the hands of somebody else, it's, it's heartbreaking. These are the guardians of the children, and this garden of pinwheels represents the number of children who've been abused last year in Racine County, each spinning fan representing a young boy or girl. Unfortunately, we live in a world where we have these monsters that want to abuse innocent children, and that's not something that I, anybody should stand for, anybody should stand back and be silent about. The county health officials say the numbers have been on the decline the past few years, but last year's are significantly down, and this number, health officials say, can't be trusted. Children weren't seen. They weren't seen at school. They weren't seen in their recreational activities. Basketball coaches, football coaches, ba uh, baseball coaches didn't see kids. When mandatory reporters aren't seeing vulnerable children like they would pre-pandemic, the cases aren't being addressed. We know that number is higher. We know there are more children out there that, that need that. And so as things start to open up and have been opening up, we've seen a small increase. It's a reminder to stay vigilant to protect the most vulnerable. In Racine, Evan Peterson, Fox 6 News. Evan, thank you for that. If you or someone that you know is experiencing abuse, helpful resources can be found on our website. Just head over to fox6now.com.